It's interesting. A lot of people will talk about, so to me, and I'm not an expert in astrology, so please know that I, I respect the science of astrology. It's been around for a very long time. And to me, when I perceive it, it's the imprint of like the state of the, it's like an energetic imprint of at the time stamp that you were born of what the greater energy of the universe is doing. Okay. okay. So that to me is what it is. I'm not saying that's what everyone's interpretation is, but to me, that's what it is. Here's the fascinating thing. We are at a point in consciousness where consciousness is rising very quickly. As you free yourself from the distortion, as your, your frequency resonance rises, I'm starting to see this. People can transcend their charts. Mm. They can transcend what the chart tells them is going to happen. Not maybe, it depends on how high your frequency resonance is, but you get to the point where it's, it's not like you're going counter to the universe. Please know I'm not saying that. Mm. But you realize your sovereignty as co-creator. You and the universe are creating together, right? So you're empowered to create something different if you want it. And it's, it, it sounds funny because it sounds like then you're just like dictating your will. And it's just the way you want. But at that state, in order to even be able to do that, you have to be in a state of surrender from strength and neutrality. Does mm. that make sense? You're not controlling in the same way. No, it's coming from a different it's coming, source. Exactly. Yeah. It comes from a totally different place. So it really, like most things, depending on how high your frequency resonance is, you have more or less ability to be bound by your chart or to transcend it. And... I'm really starting to see people who are starting to transcend their charts. Mm. And it's kind of amazing, actually, because, like I said, when we truly, truly start to understand and recognize our sovereignty as co-creator, it's a really spectacular thing because it breaks the illusion of the physical reality, you know, that we're subject to life, what happens to us, just a greater power that we have no control over, that we have, you know what I mean, that we're like have to submit to. Right. And I'm not saying that we are greater than God. So I did not say that. Please know I did not say that. I believe that we, in that surrender from strength state, that we are completely surrendered to pure source. However, we recognize that we are an aspect of the divine. We, we claim our own divinity and that we co-create with the divine. Mm -hmm. And so as a result, we're more empowered. 